Today, we'll show you how to calibrate the barometric altimeter. The altimeter Garmin has equipped is the barometric altimeter. It calculates the elevation by measuring the change of ambient pressure. Because the ambient pressure changes all the time, you need to calibrate the barometric altimeter periodically to get the accurate elevation value. There are three ways to calibrate your barometric altimeter. 1. Manual Calibration You can enter the current elevation or sea level pressure to manually calibrate your Garmin device. If you know the current elevation, for example, you are near a triangulation point, you can enter the current value directly. The watch will calculate the sea level pressure automatically. Knowing the sea level pressure can help you predict the weather more accurately while using the barometer as well. Or, you can also enter the sea level pressure to calculate the elevation. For example, you are next to a weather station. By entering the sea level pressure the weather station provides. And the ambient pressure the watch measures, the watch can calculate your current elevation automatically. It provides you a reliable value of current elevation. Manually entering the value is the most precise way to calibrate elevation. However, you can't always get the precise reference to do it. Therefore, Garmin provides the other two ways for users to do the elevation calibration. It can also reduce the error that is caused by the change of the ambient pressure. 2. DEM Calibration DEM means Digital Elevation Model. We use open data 20 meter DEM to calibrate. Because one grid unit is 20 square meters, it's easy to know the elevation of the coordinates of a point. 3. GPS Calibration Using GPS to calculate the current position and elevation is less accurate than the other two ways. It's recommended that calculate your watch before or in the mountain climbing. We suggest that you calibrate your watch before climbing or on the way of climbing. So you can get the most accurate value when you need to know the elevation.